हाउ टू मयर अपर सेगमेंट टू लोअर सेगमेंट रेशो नाउ वी विल मयर अपर सेगमेंट टू लोअर सेगमेंट रेशो इट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज ट्रंक टू लोअर लिम रेशो इट इज एक्चुअली ट्रंक टू लोअर लिम रेशो नाउ टू गेट दिस रेशो फर्स्ट वी विल टेक द मेयरमेंट ऑफ द ट्रंक अपर अपर सेगमेंट ऑल्सो नोन एज अपर सेगमेंट एंड so the child would sit uh, on the flat floor and his occiput shoulder hips and t- will touch the wall and we will take the crown to floor height measurement then we will get the lower segment height how we take that we will take the total height and subtract the trunk height then we will get the lower segment height upper segment to lower segment ratio is greatest at is greatest at birth at birth it is about 1.7 ratio 1 and it decreases with age like in 3 years it is 1.3 at 6 year it is 1.1 and from more than 7 years it is 1 ratio 1 and when a person becomes adult it is 0.9 ratio 1 and goes on decreasing with age to lower segment ratio also it is a trunk to leg ratio and uh, for this we require that both the surfaces the floor and the wall should be flat and vertical and horizontal surfaces should be uh, like marble smooth surfaces then the child will sit here we are assuming that this is the wall and this is the floor the child will sit in such a way uh, that is that his occiput shoulders and hips touch the wall and here there is no knee, knee, uh, heel involvement we will all, only take the upper segment height now we will measure the height from above like this and we will measure it up to the uh, floor level this is the upper segment height then we will also take the total height in which uh, the occiput the shoulders the hips and the heel should touch the wall and then we will take again the uh, with uh, that we will again take with this uh, scale and measure up to floor and this is the total height and these two measurements will be taken and will be used in the formula of upper segment to lower segment ratio